Judy, the county morgue has had to add additional storage because of the number of deaths because of COVID-19 that has increased over these past few weeks. This one on the southwest side that they had to add has raised concerns among neighbors who live near the facility. What I can say is that I don't feel safe that this is happening in my backyard, like literally across the street. Rodrigo Martinez says 20 feet away from where he lives is this 67,000 foot refrigerated warehouse, most recently used by a large meat distributor. Tonight, it's been turned into a satellite morgue with county hired work crews finishing installing shelf space and equipment to store the overflow victims of COVID-19. Right now, county officials tell the ABC 7i team that 21 bodies are being kept here, some of them coronavirus deaths. That leaves Martinez and other residents of this West Elston neighborhood we spoke with both frightened and angry. I mean, we understand how it's transmitted and everything, but I don't understand how much of a risk factor we're actually stepping up considering that this is happening now. We can hold you know, around 2,000 cases and then ramp up if needed. Last week, the Cook County Medical Examiner told ABC7 they ran out of space inside the main morgue building and this refrigerated trailer in the parking lot. And tonight, a spokesperson for the ME wants to calm neighborhood fears that there is any risk to people living nearby the storage warehouse they're now temporarily using, telling the I-team that the so-called surge center poses absolutely no danger to residents. Authorities say no autopsies or any other examinations are being conducted at the warehouse and that it's strictly being used for storage. 23rd Ward Alderman Silvana Tabaris tonight echoes that, saying the center poses no health risk. Late word now from the Cook County Medical Examiner. There have been an additional 55 deaths in Cook County due to COVID-19. That raises the total in Cook County to 581 since it started. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.